Yet again, I wake up this morning to another text from my manager saying that Tommy Fury is pulling out of the fight. We agreed to all of the terms. Everything is ready to go. We're 45 days away from the fight. We agreed to his $2 million purse. We agreed to Vada testing, extra flights, extra rooms, extra tickets to the fight. We're scheduled to have a press conference next week in New York. His whole entire team was like, yeah, everything's good. We're signing the contract today, today. It kept on getting pushed. It kept on getting pushed till now. What's the excuse? Oh, I can't come and I can't do it because my dad can't be there with me during the fight. Well, Tommy, your dad has been banned from the United States for 15 years. You've known this the whole entire time. He's a criminal. He's not allowed in. When he fought Anthony Taylor in Cleveland, neither Tyson nor your dad were there with you in your U.S. debut. And now all of a sudden you need your team with you. That doesn't make any fucking sense. I will agree to not have my team around me during the fight week. I will agree to not fight with my coaches in my corner. We could both fight solo, dolo, just like Devin Haney was going to do against George Cambosos. This is what real boxers do. This is what real boxers, they make fights fucking happen. You're scared. You claim you're a professional boxer, but you don't want to make the fight with me, who you've talked so much shit about, who you said you will spark, who you say I I'm nothing compared to you. Where's all that shit talk now, Tommy? You're a fucking atypical professional boxer who doesn't want to make this fight actually fucking happen. This is the biggest opportunity of your fucking life, and you're fumbling the fucking bag once again, and I can't believe how fucking stupid you are. Fucking idiot.